It hurt our staff. It hurt our customers. Not cool. Just not cool. New at 630, the owner of Shuffles Board Game Cafe in downtown Tulsa says someone vandalized a sign inside their business. Fox 23's Jenna James learned the owner's upset because the vandal destroyed a message of inclusion. The sign inside of Shuffles welcomes everyone and they still welcome everyone except those who choose to vandalize. To Shuffles owner Eric Franson, vandalism at the board game cafe wasn't on his bingo card this year. Being inclusive was the goal from the start. We wanted to have a place that was literally had the best board games and was open and inclusive to every single person. That's always been the foundation. But video from inside the shop on March 7th shows a customer not returning that same sentiment. Cameras caught someone pointing and laughing at the sign that reads, everyone is welcome. After that, a guy in a cowboy hat walks up, tears down the welcome sign and crumples it up. I would just ask him why, why would you do that? They posted that they work hard to ensure that Shuffles is a safe place for staff and customers. Shuffle's general manager, Amanda Maples, posted the video. She's designing a new sign. I think she's taking this on personally as well. So she's going to design something cool for us, and we can't wait to get it up here. They also made a donation to nonprofit Oklahomans for Equality. We just said this is for equality. And if the customer in the cowboy hat sees this story, Shuffle's and neighboring business Magic City Books have a message. I would ask him to apologize to my staff. Mainly. I hope that he finds space for love and kindness in his heart and, you know, think before you act next time. And who knows, maybe through kindness, there's hope for making amends by being inclusive. I always think that there's a path to redemption uh, for everyone. In downtown Tulsa, covering news that matters, Jenna James, Fox 23 News. Shuffle says they are now creating a policy to deal with customers who make their staff feel unsafe.